Hello friends, welcome. My name is Dave. Thank you for joining me on this fragrance hobby. Today we'll be looking at the house of Molinar. Uh, recently I have uh, the few reviews on this house because it's one of my very favorite house. It's a niche house, a uh, French perfume house that um, family owned. They start making fragrance like down here, 1849 in the uh, city of Grasse, France is where the Paul the the birthplace of the uh, modern perfumery is mainly uh, recognized for that and they have a lot of ingredients made from that place especially floral flower and so forth now today is gonna be patchouli now if you don't know much about patchouli it's gonna smell sweet it's gonna smell a little bit like a chocolate just a bit touch it's gonna smell woody it's gonna smell earthy now I often go hiking, especially uh, after rain. And if you go ever done that, you know you walk into the the the, the park or the forest, and uh, with greenery surrounding you, trees, bushes, flowers. The dirt itself was have a certain texture, a, a smell uh, that is so calming, and soothing, and patchouli for me. That's the main thing that I smell. I do also pick up the sweet nuance of the chocolate and so forth but um, what I associate with with is mostly walking on on the um, on the nature on the earthy place just like right here outdoor I can hear bird chirping insects uh, chirping or birds singing and um, dogs barking <laughs> but it's such a nice um, uh, 75 degree on the outdoors it's such a great springtime Today is actually um, Easter, so uh, everybody's just relaxing and I think I can smell some um, barbecuing going on in the air somewhere, all right? Now this patchouli came out in 2015. The glass, the bottle itself, it's just, it's gorgeous. The coloration, the purple coloration, I just love it. Uh, the cap has a little logo on it, it says Molinar. Um, this is such a great house. I mean, one of my very favorites because um, it's they. That's what they do. They do fragrance. Okay, they focus on it. That's what they do best, and they've been around for so long. That's one of the things that I love is when a house is a classic house that's been around for a while, and they stick to what they're doing you know, and the best. Even though it's, um, we don't see this in the stores around here. Not often do you see this in the um, uh, in in stores in like Macy's or or you know um, Nordstrom or any place like that. But um, um, you could pick this up online. So um, a lot of us gotta do it blind buy. That's what I did. I did blind buy a couple of bottles and I fell in love with it. So I started buying a lot from the whole collection. And it's such a great house. I really enjoy their fragrance. Now along with patchouli, that's the dominant note you're gonna get also the sweet vanilla and then you're gonna get some geranium geranium um, it has a little bit of um, a rose flavor texture and then you're gonna get the sweet uh, not sweet but you know a little bit of a the sandalwood woody scent you're gonna get um, my favorite floral the neroli it's in there and there's some orange touch and musk okay now but uh, make no mistake the main yeah the very very dominant note is going to be patchouli uh, sometimes you know the dominant note is mixed very well in the in the um, in the ingredients and then it's going to be part of the whole core but then for this one it's going to be mainly the patchouli with some supporting sweetness coming from the vanilla and the um, you know, geranium so forth but yeah if you like patchouli this is a patchouli dominant fragrance but um, yeah, I just absolutely love this. One of my very favorite patchouli uh, fragrance. Now, patchouli, you could also layer it with, um, uh, if you have a vanilla dominant fragrance, it works really well with that. So in this uh, house, they actually have another bottle. It's called patchouli vanilla or vanilla patchouli. And um, it, it makes those together and it works really, really well. The sweetness coming through very strong as well. So. And with that said, this is one of my very favorite for the springtime where the weather is just perfect around 70 or 75 degrees, not too hot, not too cold, where you're just hanging around. And um, I think most people enjoy this, you know, 
um, they might get the earthy um, earthy notes or they could think of it like a sweet chocolate okay so both are you know if you if you um, ever eat chocolate cake and you think about it it actually does have the texture of the earthy texture earthy meaning it sounds bad like dirt but then it is a sweet type of dirt after it rains it actually is very very pleasant very soothing very calming and that's why a lot of people go on hiking because they want to smell nature and that's what you know it comes through for them so this absolutely does that for me uh, i really 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 enjoy this one you know to give it a gray i'll give it a nine out of ten it, it is that good um you know a lot of fragrance i love I'll, I'll give very high scores because they're really that good and a lot of them are so so i'll give it maybe six or a six out of ten but this is a nine out of ten that tells me you know tells tells how much i really enjoy this one so just imagine patchouli notes with some uh, vanilla touch in be, you know behind it but it's a minor touch so the sweetness is not overwhelming it's not cloying it's not overly sweet it's not bubblegum sweet i say that a lot because a lot of the recent uh, modern fragrance are very bubblegum sweet but this is not that okay this is very relaxing uh, chocolate chocolate cake kind of sweet but not over, but not overdone all right then uh, i hope that is helpful i mean i really encourage you to go look at this house their fragrance are relatively pretty cheap you're looking at maybe you know 40 50 dollars per bottle these are 75 mil yeah 75 mil this is edp now as far as the longevity it does last pretty long maybe six hours plus no problem and um, you can wear it anywhere you know any age can wear this um maybe not clubbing maybe hmm maybe not clubbing okay other than that you can wear it to school in the office and so on and so forth so um it's a very easy going type of scent i absolutely love this one i keep saying that because and i keep saying it and i keep picking it up to smell it just how much i love it yep okay that's a very quick take i hope this helpful as always uh, thank you so much for watching and see you next time